Firstly, Bangladesh versus Pakistan at Lords, the beautiful Lords. Uh, there's no such thing as a, a dead rubber. Um, both teams desperate to beat each other. Uh, we certainly are, and I'm pretty sure they are. They've got a lot to play for as well. Uh, so no, we, we're, um, we're looking to obviously win. We want to win. Um, we've practiced well today. We've come up with some good plans. Um, when we lost against India, it wasn't a case of it was we were out the tournament, but we all recognised that there was one more game to go and one special occasion at Lords uh, and a very good, uh, tough team to beat as well. So if we can take the scalp of Pakistan in a World Cup, we'll be very, very proud of the boys. Great question. Thank you very much for asking it. Um, the reason I say that is I don't like to give away too much tactically uh, going into a game because I get a lot of my information listening to head coaches on the media uh, from the opposition. So I don't like to give away too much. Uh, I won't be telling you what we're going to do at the toss or how we approach the game. All, all I will be saying is there's a game to win for Bangladesh and that's the important thing for us. No, no, I don't, feel, I don't really feel the pressures of that because, you know, with Bangladesh, we've got a lot of pressure of 170 million back home <laughs> uh, wanting us to win. But without the tournament, Pakistan can still qualify. Maybe the pressure's all on Pakistan going into this game. So all our game, but I, I think that what we look at, we, we do take games day at a time, match at a match at a match. But the thing is, if you look back to that India game, uh, we, we didn't turn up for those first 20 overs when we were in the field. That was a bad area for Bangladesh. We know that, we've addressed that, we know what we want to try and, try and do tomorrow. Uh, if we can start the game well against Pakistan, then we don't have to play catch up. Uh, and that's what we did against India. So really we want to try and improve that. Um, there were some other aspects of our game we want to just, you know, obviously sustain and, and, and try and do what we did against India, which was fight hard. Um, and we played well at times with the bat during that game as well. So, you know, but that's the main area. We want to start the game really, really well. You know, we know that in Bangladesh, the, the, the fielding side is not as, as good as Australia, as England, as New Zealand. Um, we know we're going to have some um, not so good days. And then when we do have a good day, uh, it really does help the win or the performance of the team. We do try hard, we do work hard. We're possibly not as athletic uh, as some of the other teams, um, but it's not an area we neglect. It's an area we still work very, very hard on. But we also know that we have good skills with bat and ball. And uh, it's a very delicate balance, which is enhancing those skills even more and making us a difficult side to bowl at and a difficult side when we bowl to bat against. So the balance is trying to improve everything and fielding comes into that. Um, but presently as well, we can really, really improve our batting and bowling skills as well as our fielding. Well, we would have loved to have qualified for the later stages. So in, in that case, uh, that's a disappointment. But the victories have been very good. Um, certainly the early victory with South Africa, West Indies, but actually the Afghan game, um, you know, we've, they're a tricky side for Bangladesh. We, notoriously, they play well against us. So a professional performance against them we needed and we got. So that was a really good victory. Um, it would have been great to beat Sri Lanka. I'm sure they would have felt the same way of trying to beat us, uh, but that wasn't to be. We can't do anything about that. If we beat Pakistan, I think we've had a, a very good World Cup, even though we've not qualified. And I say that because the other teams, some of the big teams that we've played against, you know, we've had close-ish games against them. We've pushed them. Australia we pushed. India we've pushed. We had a a not great game against England, apart from a magnificent 100 from Saqib. But generally the games we've played, we've been in the contest and we've showed a lot of fight. We carry on doing that, then we're going to improve and improve and improve. Yes, you, you, you comment about the best team um, to represent Bangladesh. At the moment, is there more to come? Yeah, the, the one thing about uh, Mashraf with the players is that you know, they respect him incredibly. Um, I, I often use the word warrior, but he, he goes to war for the team, does, does Mashraf. And people respect that, understand that. And they, 
they love him because of that and and the players in the dressing room do love mash and this is he has said it's his last world cup and they will be uh, emotional for him my job is to yes let's let's get that done let's understand the um, and and respect Masha's situation regarding his last game in World Cup, but then concentrate on the cricket. So uh, hopefully the boys will, will give him the right sort of respect playing his last game in the World Cup, but then most importantly, we'll concentrate on the match. That's one of the areas that we're getting a little bit better at. You know, we, you, we've seen some good performances from Lytton Das in this tournament. Uh, Sumi Saka has been consistent without a big score. Uh, but he's shown what he can do leading up to this tournament. Mozadek in Ireland and also in this tournament has, has been successful. M uh, Miraj Mahedi Hassan has, has also been consistent from Ireland to the World Cup. Um, uh, Mustafiza never really gets a mention, but he's played 60 odd ODIs and he's, he's been, he took a great fifer against India. I was very proud of that. So we've had contributions and Long may that continue, and I think that that is one area that we're now showing signs. I call them our medium sort of players, but they, it won't take them long. They'll become the main sort of players, but I think the, the most important player is actually the team, the team doing well.